Immersive is the new standard. More and more DAWs come Dolby Atmos enabled. But to be able to explore these new capabilities, you need to be able to hear what you're doing. You need immersive monitoring. The most common format is 7.1.4. That's seven speakers around your listening position, as well as four ceiling speakers, plus a subwoofer for the LFE channel. That's 12 speakers in total. With the KH line of studio monitors, Neumann offers excellent loudspeaker solutions. But what if you work in, in a home studio? You may not have the budget or even the space for 12 loudspeakers. What if you need a mobile solution for working on the road or on location? The answer is RIME. RIME stands for Reference Immersive Monitoring Environment. RIME allows you to monitor surround and immersive formats such as Dolby Atmos on Neumann headphones in reference quality. Others have tried this before, so what makes RIME a better solution? First of all, RIME is tailor-made for Neumann headphones. So rather than sounding okay with dozens of headphone models, RIME focuses on sounding perfect with Neumann headphones, the NDH20 close back and the NDH30 open back. This enables RIME to incorporate all their acoustic properties. Also, Neumann headphones are made to extremely tight tolerances to ensure sonic consistency. And they are designed to have the same carefully balanced sound as a Neumann KH line loudspeaker setup. Second of all, RIME sounds real. Because it is real. RIME is not based on simulations. RIME captures an actual control room. Neumann built a reference listening environment, optimized by their acoustics experts, and outfitted with KH-Line speakers for ultimate precision. Fine-tuning was done using the MA1 automatic monitor alignment. This ideal listening environment was captured using the legendary KU100 binaural microphone. We call him Fritz. Fritz has microphones in his ears and conveys a stunningly realistic 3D sound image when you listen on headphones. Fritz was placed at the listening position and connected to the MT48 audio interface with state-of-the-art preamps and converters. So that's how Rhyme works and what makes it special. It gives you access to surround and immersive monitoring via headphones. And the entire signal chain used for the capturing process was reference quality Neumann equipment. KH line speakers aligned with MA1, recorded with the KU100 binaural head via an MT48. And to ensure that this impeccable signal chain extends all the way to you, Rhyme is tailor-made for Neumann headphones. And there's a secret ingredient. The impulse responses recorded with Fritz are processed in the plugin using groundbreaking MBO algorithms. The result is perfect clarity without unwanted coloration and without any phasiness. Rhyme sounds real. Next, I'm going to show you how to work with Rhyme. Rhyme comes as a plugin for all major DAWs in the usual formats VST3, AU, and AAX. Because RIME is used for monitoring, it is typically applied to the output bus or monitor bus. Let's say you want to mix in Dolby Atmos. Create a 7.1.4 bus. Insert RIME. And on the first two outputs, you will have a two-channel binaural signal. If you're using the Dolby Atmos renderer, RIME must be inserted behind the Dolby Atmos renderer. In RIME, apply the appropriate settings. On the left side, select the input format, in this case, 7.1.4. On the right hand side, choose the headphone model you use. As was said before, RIME exclusively supports Neumann headphones to ensure optimal translation. I'm using the NDH30, so that's what I'm going to select in the plugin. The main section shows a top view of the control room. Here you can mute and solo individual channels by left or right clicking the corresponding speaker icon. The ambient slider below allows you to add more or less room to the headphone sound. 
The default setting gives you an excellent natural sounding balance. So there's usually no reason to change anything. And the same goes for the high and low shelf in the headphone profile. The default setting should give you a very natural balance. But you can easily dial in a brighter or more bass heavy sound if you like. On the left there is a display for head tracker devices. Rhyme supports OC compatible head trackers such as this one from Supperware. With the head tracker the 3D sound image reacts to your head movements, which is cool for some applications, but for mixing it's not essential. Let's have a look at the settings page. On the right you see ITD parameter. ITD stands for Interaural Time Difference. Your individual head size may differ slightly from the KU100 binaural head. By compensating for this difference, Rhyme sounds even more realistic and 3D. Simply measure your head circumference and the distance between your ears. Enter your data and hit Calculate. Done. On the left hand side you can enter your license code. Without a license code you can test Rhyme for 14 days without any restrictions. There are some additional settings. You can boost the LFE signal by 10 dB which is the standard setting for Dolby Atmos. Room view activates a different visual for the main plugin window. Hmm, looks nice. Room view doesn't have the loudspeaker buttons, but you can still mute and solo individual channels on the left hand side. By the way you can use Rhyme for stereo playback too. It makes your headphones sound like monitor speakers. So the stereo center is not inside your head as is typical for headphones. The stereo center appears in front of you. That allows you to check your mixes for loudspeaker compatibility on your Neumann headphones. And that's all. As you can see Rhyme is really easy to use. Instead of confusing you with options you don't need or multiple rooms each sounding different, Rhyme gives you one reference room as a single source of truth. Which makes it easy to make decisions and create mixes that translate perfectly to all playback systems. Thanks for watching, see you next time.